Well, how y'all doing today? I hope y'all having a blessed day. So I am at uh, Kroger's because I had a mess thrust upon me and I had to uh, figure out how to straighten it out. Go ahead, please. Uh, and I'm curious as to what the beef looks like here since they've had that nationwide recall. It's supposed to be a nationwide recall on, uh, I think they said it was just hamburger. And they're still gathering that up. And they're, they're telling people to find an alternative. Until they get that mess straightened out. Well, it looks like they have some beef here, but it's going sky high. Um, yeah, so uh, if what I read on Google is true, they're definitely going to be having uh, the price of chicken and pork. The alternative they're talking about is going to go sky high. I'm going to get me some of these because I want to make some minestrone soup. I usually put hamburger in it. Uh... Oh, wait a minute, what's that? Oh, mild Italian, all right, that's fine. And I'll buy the stuff in the can and I'll doctor it up. I'll put hamburger and Italian sausage in it. And usually I just have that uh, with some uh, garlic Texas toast. Oh, I don't wanna go down that way. I'll tell you, ramen's gotten scarce. That's for sure. Just try finding it in a cup. You know, you used to be able to get it in a, a six pack. Can't get it no more. Milk done jumped up again uh, on my Walbrat uh, app. See what milk is here. Oh, I don't even see a gallon of chocolate milk here. Just a half gallon. Ooh, a gallon of whole milk is five forty nine with your card. Uh, without your card, it's five ninety nine. Now I'm seeing another price down there at four twenty nine. I wonder why. See, see that? One shelf is $5.99 with the card it's $5.49 and the next shelf is the same exact thing. I'm gonna have to read the label. Because it's it's $4.29 with your card. So uh is what it is. I'm gonna get me some chocolate milk. Ooh, $3.29 for a half gallon of uh whole chocolate milk. I think I'll get me the 1%. Now, I bought stuff to make sandwiches because uh, I got a, a plethora of things to do, moving furniture around and everything, and I really didn't need this delay uh, with all this other mess. But uh, <laughs> I didn't get any bread. <laughs> so, behind you, I gotta get me some bread so I can make me some sandwiches and have me some soup. You know, something uh, where I don't have to cook anything real big for a couple of days. And I could just uh, concentrate on that other stuff that I have to do. You know, it's. I'm not gonna say it's always something because I ain't gonna wish that on myself. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I just ain't gonna do it. Uh, but tonight I'll probably just have me a, a sandwich and a, some soup. I'm hoping they got some fresh bread here in the in the bakery. I'm 
I'm big, I'm a stickler when it comes to bread because up north, where I'm originally from, they have bakeries all over the place. And, and you can, ooh, they got their olive bar covered up. And you can get uh, fresh bread from a bakery. So even the stores will compete with the bakeries and you can get uh, really fresh bread. Uh, that don't happen here. Anyway, uh, I might get me a good, uh, while I'm here, I know I need me some onions. I ain't been able to get those on my app. Oh, they gotta be, you're kidding me. They're calling them Lime's Lodge. And it looks like they're 79 cents a piece. Product Mexico. Must be because of the price of gas going up. I don't eat me a lot of limes, I used to. Well, that's just crazy. Some of the prices on this stuff is just crazy. Yeah, no, I can live without that stuff. And I'm not big on the maters on my sandwich now, and unless they're fresh. Like right out of a garden. All right, well, I'm gonna look around here and see if I can't get me some green onions and some fresh bread and uh, y'all have a blessed day. Bye-bye.